Today, I'm gonna to talk about the four things you absolutely need to know before applying to the Illinois MCS program. First, let's talk about what the Illinois MCS is and it isn't. The Illinois MCS is marketed as a direct competitor to the popular OMSCS offered by Georgia Tech. The MCS hasn't been around as long as the OMSCS and is more expensive. $22,000 for $7,000. The Illinois MCS is a genuine master's degree diploma in computer science and is equivalent to the MCS degree offered to the on-campus students at Illinois. This means that you'll get a degree from the number five computer science school ranked by Newsweek. The Illinois MCS is a 32 credit hour, eight course requirement degree targeted to offer busy professionals an avenue to complete their degree at their own pace. Coursera is the content delivery partner for all the program meaning all course lectures and assignments are hosted there. Let's briefly touch on what the Illinois MCS isn't. It's not the same MOOC courses offered for free on Coursera with a larger price tag and a degree slapped on the end. The lectures used in the classes are the same, but that's where the comparisons will end. You'll be working with a live instructor, TA, and peers for this semester. The assignments, projects, and exams are more rigorous than the MCS program variants. The MCS isn't for someone looking to just start learning technical skills or learn to become a software developer. The MCS is designed for experienced developers or computer scientists to further develop their skills with advanced topics. Next up, let's talk about admissions. To get accepted in the program, the primary requirement is to have a four-year bachelor's degree. It is recommended that the applicant's undergraduate GPA was 3.2 out of four or higher, and has completed coursework in object-oriented programming, data structures, algorithms, linear algebra, and statistics. If you do not meet the coursework requirements, you can take a data structures proficiency exam or take four credit college courses on your missing skills. The GRE is not required to apply to the program. As for the application itself, you'll need to provide personal information, academic history, resume, career objectives, and background essay, and finally, a statement of purpose. Letters of recommendation aren't required, but are useful to justify experience to cover for missing coursework. The Illinois MCS is a selective program and will only accept applicants that show potential to succeed in graduate level CS courses. If you're missing some of the required skills, you may need to wait several months and even a year or more to catch up on missing requirements before you get accepted. I had to wait an additional four months to take and pass the data structures proficiency exam to start the program. Next, it's important to understand what it takes for someone to be successful in a program like the Illinois MCS. Now, the University of Illinois doesn't release as much data on their program as the OMSCS does. The programs are similar enough to expect that there will be a decent amount of students who fall out of the program each semester and never reach graduation. In order to succeed, you'll need to understand the following. You need to be mentally prepared and ready to take on a rigorous and difficult program and not expect courses to be a cakewalk like some free MOOC style courses you've taken in the past. The courses I've taken are just as rigorous as any other graduate level course I've taken in an in-person program. Next, you must have a learning style and discipline that meshes with a fully online, self-driven program like the Illinois MCS. You should have great time management to sit down, watch lectures, do homework and projects, and then finally turn things on time. While there are due dates and structure around the course outlines, it's largely on the student to self-manage and get things done. Next, you need to enjoy problem solving and be driven. The courses will give you the foundation, but will not hand everything to you on a silver platter. You need to be comfortable with looking for solutions outside of class, attending virtual office hours, asking questions on Slack to survive. Next, let's talk about competition. You should be aware of the other options available to you on the market. The MCS is a great program and comes from the highest ranked computer science department offering a MOOC style CS master's degree. The biggest competitor of the Illinois MCS is the Georgia Tech OMSCS. The OMSCS is the most popular online masters in CS and has a larger course catalog than the MCS. There are other players in the market like the Arizona State MCS. Penn also offers a master of computer and information technology on Coursera. Course catalog and specialization tracks are the most important things to consider when looking at programs. Before applying to a program, make sure that they will actually help you achieve your learning goals and objectives. It is possible now with the influx of new programs on the market, there is another program that is better suited for you. Drop a comment on what programs you're interested in. I am enrolled in the Illinois MCS and I am three courses away from graduation and I don't regret it one bit. If you come into the program well prepared, I'm confident you'll have a great experience. If you're interested in learning more about enrolling in an online CS Mastery program, check out my short playlist on the process. See you in there.